All right. Hello. Welcome back. What is going on here? Uh, I guess Red's going to promote. Yeah, you guys are probably wondering what's going on here, too. I have not, uh, well, I was late posting a video this week. Um, why is that? Well, I have a new computer, getting a new uh, internet setup, and uh, what else is new? I don't think there's anything else. Okay, Yellow Mist taking there. That's what I wanted to play. The first one was a misclick, obviously. And we're playing Typhoon. Uh, Typhoon is a War for Thrones style game, I guess. Uh, you have two knights, a whole bunch of kings. There's less material, I guess you could say. Uh, that move stops red from infiltrating the center. Also kicks the knight away. I think this king is safe for now. We have that. Of course, if you only have two knights, giving up a knight for a king is a terrible idea. Um, yeah, even still, I am going to take out the knight because I don't want to give up my knight. I'd rather give up my um, give up my king in the center. We've been in kind of a little bit of a, a rating slump with bullet time control too, so I figured while my rating is down, I might as well try something new. Uh, it's not as if I'm going to totally tank things here. Um, more than they already are. Okay, so I'm hitting red there. Red's also under attack there. Okay, multi-purpose, defensive, and saving move. So we'll just step back. I want to promote this way. Do I? How do I want to promote? Um, no, I can, I can do this. I'll just promote these and get these promotions in the regular way. Uh, we've played stalemate tactics before on War for Throne and in Tic-Tac-Toe, and those tactics are very much in play here, especially with the, the Royal Pawn. Hmm. If only there was some way to attack that undefended king. I want to get my knight there, which is a little hard at the moment. Uh, let's do this, just make way for our kings to head towards the center. Okay. And we are making our way into the center. Okay, so that isn't a big threat. Is that a threat? I don't think so. Um, can I... Well, I could probably do that, couldn't I? Eh, I don't know. I'm just going to keep uh, pushing into the center, developing my pieces. If Blue wants to sacrifice Chuck, he can. Oh, of course he's going to play that. Why didn't I not see that? Um, yeah, let's do that. I guess. There. And now we tell Blue you gotta get out of here. Okay, so that's uh, that's a theme that we have to look out for, I guess. Um, now, if I take this, it's difficult for me to stalemate myself. But, if I leave that there, then we have stalemate possibilities for later in the game. I don't want to do that. I know that much. Red is strong in the center here. I think maybe I can get a, a defensive uh, front just with these two kings. We'll see. Okay. So that's an option for blue. Red won't allow that. Okay, paying attention to everything that's happening here. I think probably stepping back, promoting. Get our last few promotions in. Is 
Is blue going to try and mate me somehow? I don't know. But red certainly does look scary in the middle there. Green's making waiting moves. Yeah, it's difficult for green now that he got rid of both of his uh, knights. Probably want to step back here just so that there's no threat of a capture from blue. And if blue captures, I maybe have this opportunity. I'm going to go for it. Might be a bad idea. Yeah, red can capture. Blue should capture um, here. Now, if blue just backs up, okay, so blue's going to capture, or sorry, red's going to capture. Now, yeah, I was saying red could back off. Um, and then blue would almost certainly capture one of mine. 1500 rated player, it's difficult to know whether or not they appreciate uh, what it means to cooperate. And in general, I think that was probably the best move at the, at the time. Okay. Um, here. Okay, green has the same idea as I do. Let's just... Uh, Let's just step up. I was considering stepping back, but red could always capture there. It's not a good move, but it would be a damaging move for me. All right. And now we have control of the center. I'm just nervous that if I start, uh, if I bring my royal king to the center, um, the same fate will befall me as we saw uh, with red. I think here, guarding this square, this is a this is a choke point. Okay, so I can still do this and I have this material to to uh, free my royal pawn slash king. Let's just bring all of our material to the center. Blue's almost down on time. Although there is an increment here, so that's quickly gained back. Um, okay. I don't know about that move by blue. Capture. Yes. Okay. Now blue steps up. No, my, because my. My knight still guards that choke point. Now blue doesn't have any knights, so I think now it's going to be fairly easy for us, as long as green doesn't infiltrate. Do we bring our last king over first, or the, just the royal king? I'm not sure. Maybe someone's going to try and catch us in a pre-move. Uh, Here, green steps up, red could capture, I'll recapture, and we're doing fine. My knight still guards blue. There's this, and good game. So, that was me figuring out uh, the, the variant Typhoon. I hadn't played it once or twice before, but uh, this was interesting. Yeah, I, I like the variant. Some good strategies going on there. It's very similar to kind of the ideas that we see in War for Throne and Tic-Tac-Toe. So that was this variant. Um, I apologize for the shorter video this week, but good news is uh, big things are coming. Like I said, I have a new computer. Uh, it was time to upgrade, so I have a new computer, uh, faster, and I'm getting better internet. So I think... Um, I'm not committing to anything just yet, but I think streams are in the future, and uh, I'm very excited for that. hope you all are too, and uh, until next time... Mm -hmm.